Hello, I'm the Ballmeister. Welcome back to more Days Gone. Last time. Last time, we took care of a story. A big story beat. We took, we got, thankfully, the Rippers out of the camp. Although without a very large cost. We learned that Skizzle sold out Boozer and I. To Carlos, our buddy Jesse. Now Skezzo's riding in the Who's Gal. And we, Boozer and I, we have a plan. Well, I have a plan. Boozer's gonna come help me. Hey, Deke. So I'm gonna go check on the explosives to make sure, you know, the Rippers didn't steal them. And then I went to Skizzo's cabin to check on the deck cords, but I should have just come straight here and saved some time. Get the hell out of here, Ricky. I guess we can go blow up that cave, right? I'll come with you. When I was a kid, my dad found a rat's nest underneath one of our sheds. You want to know what he did? Can't even guess. Well, I waited till morning. They'd all be asleep. He laid a piece of plywood over the hole and told me to go get the garden hose. And he said to me, I never forget what he said to me. He said the best way to kill a rat's nest is to drown him. You can blow up the reservoir above the camp? Oh, that's an idea. Deacon, you can't. They want to rest in De peace. I'm going to help them out. Deacon, you can't do that. Why is that? Because Iron Mike? This is some fucking treaty. You know, I want to cut Skizzo's throat, but he's right about one thing. Carlos ain't gonna stop. Rippers ain't gonna stop. And you know it. Are you sure this isn't personal? Fuck yeah, it's personal. If you look at my arm, Ricky, you know it's personal. If you look at Boozer, you know it's personal. Boozer, I'm heading to the gate. You ready? Way ahead of you, brother. Okay, I'm almost there. <laughs> Ricky coming with us. Nice rifle. Oh, yeah. A present from Schizo. Remind me to be there when you give it back to him. He'll be there. Hop on. Let's go, buddy. <clears throat> Mr. Sword Hand. Let's go. That goddamn Schizo. So what are we gonna do with the bastard? I mean, we're not letting Iron Mike put him on trial, are we? No, we're not. All right, so what's the plan? I know the area pretty well. Sarah, uh, she worked out of a lab south of Iron Butte Ranch. I used to ride out there, pick her up for lunch. Taught her a ride on some of those back roads. Jesse, Carlos, whatever the hell he's calling himself, he's taking over the old golf course and resort. Just south of the lodge is the Crescent Lake Reservoir. Now we blow that dam, that lake's gonna flood down into the valley and it's gonna drown them all, like rats. Okay, but isn't the lodge up on a hill? Yeah, yeah, flood probably won't do much to it, but it'll do enough damage to the rest of the river compound to take out most of his men. Uh, and if Jesse survives, he won't see us coming. You got it. These two will be too busy trying not to. Now we just gotta figure out how to get into the Iron Butte Valley without being seen, yeah? I'll get us there. You just hang on. It's gonna be a little bit of a rough ride there, Boozer. Just hang on, buddy. <coughs> Thankfully, I won't need to fill up because this is a story ride after all. Mine. 
more rippers. I, got I think him. I got him. One at a time, then. Oh, you. I have a skill point. Sweet. Granted. You okay? Yeah, I'm fine. I've been better. Right behind you. <laughs> Alright, back to the bike. Shall we ride through, I guess? Works for me. <laughs> All right, hop on, buddy. I think we got everybody. It's just got to be a nice winding trip through here. We gotta head south from here. Following you. <laughs> Kinda have to. Nope, stay on the road. Got it. <clears throat> Riding on through, no big deal. Here. Eventually we'll take a take right, you know, take left or right or a center. Oh, no. here. <coughs> Pardon me, folks. <clears throat> they ain't gonna make this easy. Nope. Okay. Hey, what are you doing? Figured I'd take this bag of explosives down there and ask them if they didn't mind us, you know, blowing them the fuck up. Boozer. Look, you stay up here with Skizzo's rifle and keep him off me while I set the charges. Oh, ho hold on. Look, I got this. I'm not much good in a firefight, but I can plant these charges. I've set demo charges before, Boozer, in Afghanistan. I know exactly where to put them. Good. Tell me where to go when I'm down there. We doing this? Yeah. Hmm. All right, here's a better question. <clears throat> am I in unlimited ammo territory or am I stuck? Okay, I'm going to be up in this tower. Should give me a good view of the entire dam. I'll wait here until you get up there. All right, sounds good, buddy. All right, you ready? I'm heading in. Yeah, stay low, move fast. You got it, brother. Who's it? Never mind. Go, go. On top of the dam. Ah, got it. I'm heading there now. At last. All right, I'm setting the first charge. Done. All right, I'm moving on to the next one. Nice job, Booze Man. Keep going. Shit. Rippers, coming. Oh, 
playlist. You gotta keep them off me, bro, or this whole thing's going up, and me with it! Hey, I got this. You just get the charges planted. And I'm setting the second charge. Okay. See? Easy as hell. Is this gonna work? Help! Kick Doc as I might get. Run, Boozer! I'm pulling as fast as I can. Wait a minute, was this already? Oh, <laughs> <laughs> well, that never gets sold, does it? <sighs> Not anymore. We're taking Carlos down already? Oh boy. Look at all the X's. Brother, you uh you did a hell of a job back there. Yeah? I thought I was done for a couple of times. Yeah, I'm sorry about that. What the hell are you talking about? This is the most alive I've felt since. Uh, Shit, you remember when we got trapped by that horde in Tumalo? We ain't done yet. <laughs> I feel like I'm driving slow. Maybe it's just the fact that I'm driving for story. How many of you think we killed? I don't know. They had it coming, right? Yeah, they had it coming. I guess we all did. That... That is a statement. Alright, 
Looks like we go in on foot from here. You wanna stay? Keep any stray rippers from ripping off my bike? Yeah, I don't think we need to worry about that. And fuck that. This? This is on Jesse. You want some payback? Show him some fucking payback. Gotta do something here real quick. Come on, let's head to the lodge. Like I said, right behind you. Jesus. This must be what it looked like after Noah's flood. Came and washed away all the wicked. Yeah, except God had nothing to do with this one. Yeah. You get my point. Oh, shit. More rippers. How the hell did they survive? Oh, they didn't. They just don't know it yet. Zeke! Our left! Our left! Yeah, yeah, I got this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's right. Come on, one song. Go away. Hey! <laughs> Nope. That was a fail. That is very much a fail. Sorry for the creaking, guys. Yeah, ammo. Take our left, our left. Yeah, yeah, I got this. Got him! Bam. Good lord. <coughs> That's Boozer. That is Boozer. I grab this. <coughs> Some of that, and then I'll head back over here and... To the lodge, I guess. Reload on some ammo. He's floating a little bit. All right, lot we'll denture this way, I guess. These guys see more jack. Yeah, 
There's no way you're getting up there. <laughs> yeah. That's not Carlos up there, okay? Not this founder, rest in peace. It's fucking Jesse Williamson. Fucking low-life piece of shit scumbag who got what was coming to him. All right. Now you fucking go up there and kill that son of a bitch. All right, here goes nothing. <laughs> Oh, this is gonna be fun. Jenkins St. John, brought low by the lowly Jesse Williamson. Brought low. Oh, do you remember back in the day? You and Boozer held me down. Watch Jack burn the flesh from my back. Now, those. Whoops. <coughs> I'm at a bit, a bit of a disadvantage because I am under. Jenkins, John, brought low by the lowly Jesse Robinson. Do you remember back in the day? You and Boozer held me down. Watch Jack burn the flesh from my back. There we go. Those. Kitties. Right in the spine, my friend. I only got 50 experience for that? Probably talk to Boozer though, we're freaky freaking, <laughs> freaking out there. Yeah. It's done. And I couldn't have done it alone. <laughs> it was good being on this shit again, you know. I gotta say, shoveling shit and pulling weeds. Maybe it isn't such a bad way to spend the day. Yeah. Well, with Jesse gone, how many do you think are left? People that we knew from before, I mean. No one. Who said there's no one left? Shut. Sorry. Yeah. Me too. Come on, let's. Yeah. Okay. All right. So, just how bad have we messed up back at camp? That's the thing. We'll find out here. <clears throat> we'll see if it's gonna make me ride back to camp or if we're gonna ride back to ourselves. Either way, this is gonna be quite the experience coming up. Okay, I can move you back because. I know what I'm looking at now. Well, like I said, I... I know we haven't talked in a few years. I guess I disfigured with my Elizabeth being there with you and all. Probably wasn't much point in me yammering away at you. Hell breaking loose. I, I thought maybe you weren't there. Or you just didn't give a shit. Pardon my language. 
I guess that's why I'm here. See, I still don't know. I hope you're there. Hope there's some reason for all this shit we're living through. That's all. We'll, we'll, we'll talk again some other time. Oh, um, Damon. Deke? <clears throat> yeah, Ricky told me that I could find you here. Oh! Uh, nah, it's just these knees of mine, you know. It's reason I haven't been praying all these years. Yeah, I'm not a... I'm not a church-going type. Even after living through that shit storm in Sherman's camp. And now... After all this, I just thought, hell, I just, maybe it, now it's the time. I, uh, I didn't have a choice, Mike. Oh, everybody's got a choice, Deke. Until they're dead. It's either us or them. <laughs> it's always us or them. Always. You know the reason we're going to hell? is we can't figure out that us is every goddamn soul that ain't walking around in shit-stained pants trying to eat us! All right, you know what? You may not like it, but the world is what it is. Yeah, it is. Praying ain't gonna change that. Wishing that it was something else ain't gonna make it that way, Mike. Wish it ain't got anything to do with it. We make the world what it is by what we do. All of us. I let him go. Schizo. Ain't no way he was getting a fair trial. You let him go. Told him to ride out, not come back. Jesus Christ, Mike, you have any idea <clears throat> what the fuck you've done? Yeah. I stopped another killing. And you know what? I guess I'm good with that. Did finish the quest. I'm good with that. Trusted Iron Mike's camp continues to climb. Keep them safe. Do whatever it takes to keep Lost Lake safe. Got custom skin. Keep them safe. <coughs> Lost Lake encampment custom accent. Nice. We got a new mission unlocked. We got several things unlocked. We got. Let's see. <coughs> We've got. Ooh, we got Isla's distracted. Pick up Sarah. Pick Sarah up. Or Work for a lunchtime ride. Let's see what other stories we got. Oh, we got all <coughs> we got all bunch of stuff to take care of, and we will do so. Drown like rats. Ride up to the Oberon Nibiru refugee camp to visit Sarah's memorial stone. Okay, we'll do that. Because <coughs> we also need to go visit Tucker at Hot Springs, and Sarah is or that rock is right there. Uh, Batty Hunter. Ambush Hatter Camp, Marauder Camp, and the ne uh, Rogue Tunnel Neural Checkpoint. Now I can take care of that and hopefully be able to find a gas can. Because I think we need the gas can to get in the checkpoint. But! <coughs> you know what? Let's go ahead and do that. Mark that on our map, and we're going to end the episode right there. Thank you so much for watching. Next time, we're going to go back to Hot Springs Camp. We're going to see what... Tucker wants in hot springs. But until then, I am the Bumeister, and as always, <clears throat> I have been obediently yours.